welcome friends to excel beginners and advanced tips in our last video we saw how to find the matching records from sheet 2 that is the deposit sheet and to paste and to copy the matching record and paste the same to the destination sheet that is sheet 4 say as for example I am taking cat c our say our date criteria is between 30th December 2019 say copy now see all the matching records has been pasted to our destination sheet that is sheet 3 here our source sheet is sheet 2 that is deposit sheet and our destination sheet is sheet 4 that is the records pasted here after matching the condition we gave in the user form 2 little before and has been pasted here so friends today we want to go little further and today we want to find the matching records first as it was found in our last video but instead of co instead of copy the matching records we want to remove the matching records we want to cut the matching records from the source sheet to our destination sheet and friends for this we want to add little bit code here let's do this going to our developer tab and visual basic and here we need a command bu command button friends say the name is cut or just change it first rename it instead of copy we have uh, we, ha we got another command button that is cut and we want to copy we, we don't want to copy we don't we want to copy this we actually we want to cut the matching records from sheet 2 and if the code is similar friends like copy code and we can copy this codes from here from, from, from copy and we can paste it here just we have to replace this copy to cut option to, to cut and that, that uh, the matching record will be cut from the source sheet and will be pasted to our destination sheet and friends here we have to remind that after cut from the source sheet there will be the blank rows against the selected consumer that we want to cut from this sheet and we need to delete all the blank rows after copy after 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 cut option is acti uh, after cut is completed so hence we need to write little bit of codes here here in this form here in this area in the cut event okay click click event of the command to command button to means cut command button and we can activate we need to activate sheet 2 again and to find the blank rows and then we need to delete the rows so activate so sheet 2 dot activate actually sheet 2 dot activate and here friends we need to change the variable name say t and 
instead of x because already x is on the uh, upper section here we don't have we, we, we should we should change the variable name here we don't have same variables in a procedure so just changing the variable name again i is equal to 3 to last row instead of last row we will replace it with t as we have taken t and then if we need a if condition we need if condition here such if the if any row between the total rows that is that has been assigned to t total rows where data is found that has been assigned to t in sheet 2 if any row becomes blank found blank then we need to delete that say uh, we would have to write sheet 2 dot cells i comma 1 dot is equal to actually if any cell of the first column becomes blank that means account number becomes blank and it will be obviously blank when we apply the cut option then for denoting blank we can type 0 then we just select the blank cell first cells comma 1 dot select and then sheet 2 dot cells i comma 1 ne no then we just instead of that we can say selection dot enter row dot delete yes end if and enclosing the for with next this segment of code will be required friends just activate from here yes we need first to activate and then if and if next just few lines of code to be needed here to do our task so let's friend try this code first see what happens if I run this code just I want to select tiger and giving the date range from 1st October 2019 to 31st October 2019 and if this criteria matches and if I click on cut button let's see what happens see friends all the I am going to the sheet 4 first actually our destination sheet all the tigers all the tigers that means the uh, the customer one the breakup of customer one that is tiger has been pasted here and again going back to she our source sheet that is sheet 2 and there is no tiger friend you can see this there is no tiger or there is no blank rows a uh, blank records a uh, blank rows here again we can go further again for other other instances say we can see select parrot going to the date criteria and it is 31st january 2019 and if we cut it then then this customer c5 will be removed from sheet from our uh, sheet 2 that is our source sheet and will be pasted to our new sheet that is sheet 4 let's try cut you can see you can see the sheet 4 
yes friends only consumer 5 has been pasted here and all the all the all the records of consumer 5 have been successfully deleted from our source sheet that is sheet 2 that is deposit sheet so friends thus we can remove our desired record on on the following criteria as we showed in our early in our last videos if this criteria matches the records will be removed from the source sheet and to be pasted to our new sheet that is sheet 4 say tiger there is no record of tiger you can see say uh, 3 cat now we want to find the cat the consumer 3 on the following criteria into the deposit sheet that is sheet 2 and want to remove from here and to be pasted to our destination sheet that is sheet 4 so if we click on cut let's see all the cat has been removed from our deposit sheet go to sheet 2 deposit see there is no cat here and all the cats have been pasted to our destination sheet and friends we can see still there is blank some blank rows here and if we want to remove these rows double checking we can go to our initialize and we can paste this again this code of line in the top of initialize as it, uh, the form will be loaded the following actions will be performed so let's go into our initialize event uh, yeah, uh, let's let's run this see what happens just you can see there is no blank row and if we want to copy uh, if we want to cut here the elephant C record C2 okay C2 giving the date criteria suppose 10th 2019 and 30th October 2019 just cut and see there is no record of elephant here and see in the destination our destination sheet elephant has come here and if we run it again just load it see all the blank she blank rows of the remaining blank rows all the remaining blank rows of the of our source sheet will be removed like this so thank you friends thank you very much if it is little helpful to you please subscribe this channel and it will be a great boost for us thank you friends